<clears throat> so I wasn't able to record the schema editor that came up so I created a Google Doc of it and I'll put this in the description of this video so you guys can comment on it. So what you have to do is uh, click on the ellipses button, uh, the schema editor will come up, click the plus button, and then you can add a record to this site here. Uh, the important part on this part is, so you create a column name, database name, doesn't matter what the name is, as long as you're consistent uh, way through. Uh, the important part is you ha it has to be a type object. This is going to be the result set object which is going to hold uh, all of your results so that this component can parse it. So then you add the rest of the fields that you want to get from the row component. Uh, click OK and click on the parse record set um, component and then go down to this and where it says preview comp column list you want to uh, click on the arrow button there and choose result set or whatever you named that column. Then you click sync columns and then the fields of populate that are um, that you put into the uh, row component. The last thing is to put a value here and the value will be the name of the column that you want to parse out. Do not put a value for the result set otherwise it will try to parse uh, the result set object and it will throw an error. 